Uh, I'm Mikhail Gishowski, and I'm a team lead uh, on the LMS educational team. Uh, and today I'll be uh, discussing a little bit more about what our team uh, has uh, achieved uh, during this sprint. Uh, okay, so uh, we have a couple of demos. Uh, I will demo the great user report, and Ilya will demo the uh, great single view report. Okay, so this is currently the zero state of the user report. Uh, in the tertiary navigation area, we uh, uh, moved and introduced new uh, selectors for the group and also users. So um, this is currently how it looks like. Uh, currently, it opens up in a model, but uh, we, we are planning to um, move this into a drop-down menu. Uh, so once you select the user, uh, you can see the user report for that particular user. We've uh, changed the styling of the uh, view mode selector. And for the report itself, uh, again, we've introduced functionality to toggle the visibility of the categories uh, within the report and also introduce uh, this uh, navigation at the bottom where uh, teachers can easily navigate from the uh, to the previous or the next uh, user report. Um, thanks, Mikhail. Uh, hi, my name is Ilya. I'm a developer in Alpha Team and also integrator. Uh, let me share the screen and do some demo. Cool. So uh, let's just quickly compare the way uh, single view looks now and the way it's going to look um, in um, Moodle 4.1. So uh, this is what currently is. You see the edit switch pretty much does nothing. You still can do uh, grades override and uh, stuff is editable. So in our case, uh, this is going to be a few uh, a full uh, read mode. Like um, grades can can be edited. We can't do override. Uh, we also change some um, columns view. Like um, um, show grades for grade items is uh, switched to with uh, with grade items in in order. Um, grade analysis is a uh, drop down now. Uh, uh, also, uh, we have this toggle, grade items and user. And depending on of the toggle states, you will have a user search or grade item search. Um, and if we switch the edit mode now, everything, well, uh, whatever can be editable becomes editable. Uh, you can do uh, grades or write, um, you can do uh, write the feedback. And in the old mode, um, about action was um, in um, column headers. So we moved them for to a new action menu, which is also only available uh, in edit mode. Uh, so if you do um, a write known, uh, yeah, like this, exclude all, exclude known. Um, and uh, last part is bulk insert. So Previously, it was hidden in the bottom of the table, so it's a bit hard to find. Um, uh, now, we also moved it to action menu, so it's here now, uh, and it's going to pop uh, as a model. And we also have a warning, because sometimes when you have unsaved uh, changes on a page, it clashes with the bulk insert, so a user should be warned. And so the save button only becomes available when user click like I understand the risk and select the appropriate option whether he wants to write all grades or empty grades um, and then click save and yeah that's how it works now grades are written 